Hello you fellow musicians and gamers out there, this is Quiner Gamer here and I am back once again with Let's Play Sonic Mania's Encore Mode and this is part 6 guys, this is officially part 6. For some reason I ended up thinking it was part 7 but it's actually part 5. But anyway, uh, I am here today to start off with Mirage Saloon Zone and let's continue shall we? Now like I said before at the end of the last part, I'm a bit confused by this because uh, this is uh, Knuckles' version of uh, uh, Mirage Saloon Zone which is a little bit confusing if you ask me. And I lost my opportunity right there to switch to another character, but... Oh well, oh wait, no, the opportunity's not gone yet. Okay, I'm back to playing as Mighty again. And that's not too bad. That's pretty good, uh, actually. Actually, I'm curious, what's down here? I actually thought that was a special stage there for a second, but it's not. Well, not that I'm complaining or anything, I have to be honest, I quite like the Knuckles' version of this level compared to the normal version because the Caterpillar boss at the end of that is so annoying. And I'm actually glad I'm playing as Mighty because uh, without Mighty I would not have been able to access that blue ring box down there to keep my rings intact and make a big ring if I lose them. Okay, I need to get used to the pinball controls again. Alright, there we go. Actually, what's down here? Hmm. Well, I don't need to go to that pinball stage again unless if I lose another character, so I'm not going to do it this time around unless if it's absolutely necessary. It's a more interesting take on it, I think. That being said, I think the stage looks similar to what Knuckles' stage. It looks a little bit lighter and less dark. Because I remember when I played as Knuckles on this off-screen, I remember that... And Knuckles' version of this looked a lot lighter and morning feeling like. Whereas this looks a little has a little bit more of a sunset feeling to it. And that's why I'm glad I'm playing as Mighty, because of the spike protection that you get. It's a uh, it's really effective if you ask me, and it's really good for beginners. That's what I like about Mighty Mighty's character here so far. Okay, and so far we're making our way towards more pinball-esque uh, elements. I'm glad the Mighty is being a really good help. Uh, sorry, Ray. Keeping the cat doesn't need mixed up here. I feel like sometimes I'm doing it deliberately and I don't know why. And I do apologize if, if that's the case. What is this way anyway? Uh, looks like it's going nowhere. Ah, this guy. I remember him from Spring Yard. Okay, crap, okay, I lost my shield. That's not a good sign. Okay, I'm back to playing as Knuckles again. Well, well fitting. Uh, that's very fitting, actually, because, well, this is Knuckles' stage, of course. I mean, it is very fitting to play as him right now. Okay, maybe I was supposed to go this way. I didn't think I was supposed to go that way, but I guess I was. I uh, see, that kind of sucks. I'm not playing as, as mighty just now because I would have been able to access that red spring there. Ah! Was that you, Ray, who did that? Come on. You trying to purposely screw me over here? Ah! In fact, I don't need this. What am I, what am I needing that for? I could just use Knuckles' glide and climb ability. I don't need that puny thing. Oh, okay, right, we swapped uh, characters here. So I'm now Tails and Sonic's now following me. I remember making that joke before in my Let's Play, joking about how Sonic's now following me. Well, that joke's now about to be erased because we're back to now playing as Knuckles and Ray again. Uh, boss time, I'm guessing? It looks like it from the way it's going. Oh, maybe not. Okay, maybe not, not boss time yet. Okay, there's still nothing else down here. I always remember one of the trophies being from Rash Saloon Zone that, that if you push a battle you get access to a special stage. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe this is the boss. Oh, okay, right. Maybe that large Caterpillar boss that I was talking about before, guys. Maybe it might actually happen. And I don't know, I think that's quite a bad thing because I absolutely hate this boss so much. So don't be surprised if I lose quite a lot of characters. 
Oh wait a minute, this looks different. Very different. Maybe this is actually somewhat to what is in, in Knuckles' uh, story, perhaps. Well, thankfully I'm Tails and uh, thankfully the... Oh wait, oh, whoa, okay, that was close. Right, is that going to roll across? Okay, that's going to jump up. Ah, crap, okay. That shouldn't be too hard. Alright, there we go. Just one more head needed and that was it. Okay, there we go. Well, that was a bit unexpected for Act 1. I actually expected that to take place in the plane, but thank goodness it didn't. I actually prefer the platforming section of this more than the, the plane, if you ask me. Alright, what does Act 2 look like then? Okay, so the exact same design as it was in Act 1, but the the Magician Hardboard Heavy Robot will most likely be the boss again. I'd be kind of surprised if it was not the boss. Oh, hang on, what if I push this? Where does this uh, get me towards? Hmm. Mm. Oh, hey. Uh, okay, so I'm back to playing as Ray again. That's a good thing. It's like, mighty, good god, why am I mixing up these names? Oh. I call you, I'm not a Sonic fan if I'm mixing up these names. Oh, that's kind of embarrassing that I'm mixing up these names. Mighty and Ray. Mighty the Armadillo. Why do I need to why do I need to keep on telling myself that? Oh. Alright, let's get these room boxes, I'll need them. Just in case if I run into any trouble. Oh, whoa. That was close. Thank goodness for Mighty's uh, spike enduring abilities. And I think I've just gone the wrong way, haven't I? Oh no, maybe not. Wait a minute. What's through here? Oh, I can't go that way, okay. Alright, then let's swap to being Sonic again. And I lost my rings again. It seems like Sonic really likes to lose his rings in dialogue, doesn't he? I'm hoping I jinxed that when I said that. I really hope I have jinxed that in a much more positive way. As a matter of fact, guys, I was talking about Mirage Saloon Zone earlier. Here's a good question of the video for this. Which version of Mirage Saloon Zone Act 1 do you prefer? Do you prefer flying in the plane or do you prefer the more platforming section, aka Knuckles' version of this level? I've already said enough about what I think, so it's up to you, so I'll quite like to hear what you guys think of that. So what do you think? Uh, do you prefer the platforming or the plane level? That's the question of the video for this part. And it seems like this has more of a sunset or a nighttime kind of feeling. So it seems like it's taking place more at nighttime in encore mode this zone, which is which is not too bad. I quite like it actually. It's pretty it's very pretty if you ask me. Oh, and we're at the boss already, that was very quick. And yep, it's the same boss, I'm guessing. Yes it is. Okay, so this is gonna be a piece of cake or the say that. And he's going to change in the next character, which is Bean. Remember this guy from uh, Sonic the Fighters. He was a bit of a pain, as, as well as uh, Fang. This guy, however, is a pain. Oh, I nearly got him there. Ah, crap, okay. Right, this guy is a pain. I've forgotten what his name is, and I'm actually... Come on. Right, there we go. I could have beaten him right there, but oh well, never mind. I think it's one more hit, or two more hits. And that's why I do not like Fang, because of that that gun right there. Ah! At least if I keep one ring, then that's uh, good enough. Good. Right, so that's the Magician Robot defeated. And the show's over, folks. Hope you come again soon. Oh, no, I'm, I want a refund on that. That was pretty poor, if you ask me. So anyway, we got through Act 2. And this is where I'm going to end it off, guys. Because, as I said, I'm going to be doing this uh, part per zone. And I don't want to make this too long of Oil Ocean Zone. That's coming up next. As a matter of fact, this is a little bit of a preview to the next one. I'm curious to see what this is like in Encore Mode. Let's take a look at what the design's like. Okay, it looks like it's taking place during the daytime instead of at nighttime. So anyway, I'm going to end off right here, guys. So thank you very much for watching. I know this was a short part. But uh, thank you very much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Please feel free to like if you enjoyed. Uh, comment down below as well for your thoughts on the question of the video and anything else you want to say. And uh, please feel free to hit that subscribe button if you want to see more videos coming up in the future as well. 
Till then, guys, hope you have a great day, and I shall speak to you later. Till then, goodbye.